producers. Scalar 3.2 now allows you to have multi-MIDI out inside of Ableton Live. This was not possible before. Ableton Live is notorious for not having this functionality while other major DAWs do, but now you can, and I'm gonna show you how. Let's jump into it. All right, step one, if you're on a Mac, IAC driver should already be installed. I'll leave a link to this. This is how you can go ahead and activate it, make it online to use this feature in Scalar 3. Loop MIDI is the virtual MIDI cable system that I'm using for Windows, but there are a few out there. This one's super easy, super lightweight. That's why I'm using it. Now this is the loop MIDI kind of panel and you can see that there are cord board MIDI outs. This is what we're looking for inside of Scalar 3 and inside of Ableton Live to be able to do this output MIDI routing. Hey, it's Joshua from the future here. I've realized that I've been using cord board MIDI out throughout this video and this is because I have a different plugin called cord board installed which just automatically made these MIDI outs for me. You might not have this, and I just wanna show you that inside of Loop MIDI, you can just add new ports and you can even name them whatever you want. Uh, just add it, and then I have that. Yours will not say cord board unless you have that plugin, but I just wanted to clarify just in case you were struggling or ran into that. So for example, on the passages right here, if I click right here, this is where you find the new MIDI output device. Uh, I can come in here and you can see that I've chosen Cordboard MIDI Out 2. Now, if you don't have Ableton Live, you've got a DAW that works, uh, you can just use the MIDI Out on a MIDI channel. But obviously you can't do that in Ableton Live. So if we go to MIDI Output Device, go to Cordboard MIDI Out 2, and then inside of Ableton Live on a MIDI track, you can see I've got the option for Cordboard MIDI 2 Out. Select it. And if I play it, you see that I'm getting that. So I've also done that for the main track. The main track has it as well, MIDI output device. You can see I've done chord board MIDI out one. And if I come over here to this other MIDI track, chord board MIDI out one. Now you can double those up, triple, whatever you want. I can also mute these now in a uh, scaler and just use them for the MIDI, or I can keep the sounds because scalers internal sounds are great. But no matter what, we now have MIDI output individual tracks in Ableton Live, and it's absolutely phenomenal. Thank you.